Tom Donnie here. I'm going to show you how to use this zero gravity machine. I do have a spare one if you want to rent it. 50 bucks, I'll, you pay the shipping to and back, I'll rent it to you. Um, I'll tell you what, they're so easy and they make life very, very easy. Um, what, regardless whether you have one or not, I usually would try to put number two in first, then I put in the front cylinder, what I call number one, and then I put in the rear, what I call number three. I know in Sweden, this is one and this is three, but we're not in Sweden, we're in America. Number one is front, number three is rear, end of story. Anyway, um, make sure you lube this baby up. Like I've said before, lube it like it's your girl at the beach, man. Lather that baby up. And then get your uh, rings so that they're already caught in the pegs. Basically, your fingers should go over them without grabbing. So I should be able to just take this down now. And again, since this is zero gravity, you know, it just, it just does its thing. Um, I'll start the one in the middle here. Yeah, I have actually got two jugs in and found out the third one was laying outside the cylinder. That's never, never fun. But anyway, work them down in the hole. Then that'll do number one next. I'm finished if you go sideways a little bit if you have to. That'll, that'll age you a little bit. Once I, got, once I got both the front two in, the middle one and the front one, then I put the rear one in. And I tell you what, it doesn't get any easier than that with that sucker. So uh, you want to use it sometime. Again, do number two first, then number one, then number three. Um, lube it up good. Have a screwdriver ready because every now and then they don't always go in that easy. Normally they do with the zero gravity. Where you run into trouble is if you're putting a you know, 74 millimeter in. This is only 71 and a half, so I still got pretty good original grooving. Whoever bores your blocks, if you're doing a 73, 74, 74 and a half millimeter, which we have sizes for now in Wysco, um, be sure to uh, have them put a little chamfer back in there. That'll, that'll age you tremendously, right? That's all I got for putting the crank in. Tom Downey, 4 Dodge Iowa, signing out.